I'm sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but for a person trying to hide a secret, you're doing a poor job. You're doing a poor job at concealing your contempt behind your fake ass smile, your eyes that traitors, but don't worry. Your secret's safe with me, I'll just add it to the mountain of secrets I keep for strangers I've only met for a slight second or three, I, I thank you. I thank you for at least trying to hide your true emotions for some people don't even bother hiding the disgust they feel. It's painted across their face in the brightest of colors, neon pink, neon green. See, it is for this reason that I find myself overcompensating and being excessively polite to strangers that I meet, hoping that this interaction, although short, might be the key for them to look past the monsters displayed on their screens and see that in Islam, akhlaq, good character, is an important part of my deen. And that although I'm black, the only thing I steal is a quick glance in the mirror before I leave. I mean, what would it take to see that I'm no different to the every 20-year-old being I've got struggles, hopes and wishes to achieve my dreams? I'm tired. I'm tired of smiling so hard that my face gets cramped. Tired of being targeted and having to apologize for crimes I didn't commit. I'm tired of having to constantly explain myself to strangers who refuse to see that I'm individual, unique and that I've got my own story to share. But most of all... I'm tired of being tired. If you want to stay ignorant and refuse to look past all the messed up media and misconceptions about who I am and what I'm like, so be it. But know that I will never allow myself to be a picture that's perfectly tuned to your stigmas and stereotypes. Instead, I'm going to create my own frame, one that suits and represents me correctly.